to my darling Lisa. I don't even know why I'm trying to write this to you. It's not like you have fucked see it. It's you're so far away, all the way back to the States. I'm here. Away from you. Away from the kids, away from Dicky, away from Angelo. Away from it all. It's so different here. So, so fucking different. I don't worry. I. It's been so long since all this shit started. I ain't seen none of you since. I can't come to quantify hey. the feeling Part of me knows I was walking home You're probably not out there anymore That you the things that I One of these was fucking things was walking singing. around Eating people, biting people, doing all this shit But I gotta learn to Try and accept it I it's not easy. It's not. I'm lucky. You know, I... I may not have you. Or the kids. It's hard to... Come home at night and... Think that you're not there, but... I, I got good people. I got Leo. I got Puss. I got... I got Vito. Some of the only things keep me going right now. <laughs> I, uh, I hope wherever you are, wherever it's still on this mortal coil, up at the stars, I, I hope you're doing good. I hope you're well, and I hope you're happy. I just hope one day these schmucks will, will understand happiness. I love like I do you. Among the song <laughs> God fucking damn it. A league of lonesome, lonesome beauty. Skies and skies and skies above duty. I have to spend the night in Redwall. I began making my way back to the Pinnacle to meet up with Leo and the others so we can hopefully begin initiating the plan we come up with the night before. I was aware of what we're about to do. It's gonna take a lot of guts. It's, well, it's gonna take a lot of fucking planning and fucking praying. But we pull this off, you know. We've done this country a fucking service. People will realize that. They will realize what we're fucking doing. They will realize that we are the people they fucking need. Get in the car, come on, let's get the fuck out of here now. Yeah, no, I'm we gotta go, some... it's an emergency. Oh, no, we gotta go now. Come on, come on. Did you see anybody when you was in town? No. Oh.
Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, my so ship went down, Ryan. Yeah, fuck. Yeah, that's Dante back there with you. I don't know if you recognize him or not. Shit, Dante. How you doing? Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, just uh, little bumps and scrapes, you know, it's nothing, uh, nothing too bad. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see you doing good. Must be your fucking cousin out there, too. <laughs> Ronnie, we got a serious fucking problem. You remember uh, Batman and Robin, right? The motherfuckers with the uh, the wolf arm bands and the broad with the killer legs. Yeah. Yeah, dude, they're gonna be a problem. I've seen them fucking murder somebody, you know. Jeez. Me, uh, my friend Speedy, uh, Doctor Mason. We saw the shit go down. Uh, Speedy said that Dr. Mason is missing now. So if he goes missing too, then they're probably going to be coming after me next, because I witnessed that shit. They're probably trying to tie up some loose ends. Yeah, that meeting, uh, we called off that meeting too, by the way, with the Carloni family. Uh, fine, with the... Is it because of what happened now? Yeah, Buck's dead. Well, not Buck, but, uh... Carl, Jesus, God. keep calling him fucking Buck. Buck the schmuck, he's gotta die too. Buck I'm aiming that fucking gun in my face. Uh, who killed Carl then? Was those fucking people you on about earlier? The fucking, uh. Broad with the legs? Yeah, the broad with the legs. She looked at me, she said, uh, you know, you might wanna get out of here. I was like, why? And then I look over and the guy's just fucking tied up. They all got guns up surrounding him. Apparently, uh, they killed, uh, what's his name? Dr. Mason's brother. Ah, oh, yeah, I heard about him too. He was a friend of Carl's, when? Yeah, yeah. I guess the guy I've seen tied up, it had to have been, uh, Dr. Mason's brother. So, you know, I'm not no detective or anything, but uh, I'm guessing Carl seen that he was tied up. So he was like, fuck this, I gotta, I'm gotta, i gonna save my friend. Yeah. And then he fucking, he died for him. Jesus. That guy was gonna be dying anyways, to be honest with you. And he tried exposing, you know, La Cosa Nostra. Uh, no, he can't be doing that. Can't be doing that. Seems like we've got a whole lot of death going on around here. Are you telling me? Yeah, you don't even know the half of it. It's just good to have you back, Dante. Yeah, well, you know, I got, uh, got lost in the woods for a bit. You know, Leo went wrong. It was good to see Dante again. <laughs> Been a while. Last time I saw him, I was going out to fight a fucking nationalist in Livonia. The one that fucking got away. <laughs> no. What Leo said's true. We're gonna have a lot more trouble in our hands than some fucking nut who goes around killing people for the thrill of it. We all knew that this was gonna be our reality. We had to fucking prepare ourselves. We started by going to pick up one of our best soldiers, but we left in Galkino when we made that trip up there a couple days back. Pussy. One of our finest fucking soldiers we got. Hey, they fucking you wouldn't is. think what for a guy who's named after a fucking cat, he'd be good at fighting like he is. But I tell you this, you give that guy a gun, you give him some fucking ammo, you give him a target to shoot at, he gets the job fucking hey, done. How's it going? <laughs> Where the fuck you been? <laughs> fucking sleep for a while. Alright, so what's the plan for me, boys? Hey, uh, uh, well, I mean, Leo's still gonna be mad at me, but, uh... Figured, uh... We should probably go back to, uh, the tower. Uh, we 
drive the barrel off over there, you know, we can unload some of the shit out the trunk, kick to that barrel, you know, sort some things out, uh, make some room, the, and then uh, we can go on a gun run. Did you get the barrel from Spurgrad, or was it somewhere else? Yeah, 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 we got from Spurgrad. Yeah. Hey, uh, uh, what's any uh, tapes on you to put on the radio? Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't really want to fill along with it while I'm driving either. You know what these cars are like? They're looking. Uh, I might have one. I'll just get it. But I was stealing on all these cars and dog shit around. <laughs> Probably is. I'm filming. Yeah. Uh, I have one tape. I thought you want to throw that in the radio, get some tunes while we're driving. In LA, it was always me fucking driving. That's nice. Shit, when we was in Livonia, dude. You're not the drunk. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. But no, I tell you what, though, Leo, I used to drive a fucking luxury in LA. I had a big fucking Le SUV. Make sure you uh, leave the radiator in the tire in there. Make sure you remember to do that. Yeah, you can have it if you want it. Yeah, but the fucking view up here, huh? Fucking view. Oh, up I here. know. Wait until you see the top. Oh, oh, you know what, puss? You can live in the elevator shaft. Look, it's perfect for you. Hi, <laughs> oh, Dante. You're pushing your fucking luck. <laughs> Come on. Much better than it if it's fucking raining, though. Oh, yeah, no, but when it's not fucking Man, pissing thanks. down with rain, it looks quite nice. So, you get a fucking sniper up here, you'll be able to hit anybody that's fucking with us. Look, uh, we got a war coming up, so we need some fucking guns. We don't need guns, we need fucking guns, okay? That's all we need, fucking guns. Yeah, we need big fucking guns. Mm -hmm. The bigger, the better. Yeah, once the whole fucking Yeah, we need, we need to get bigger. guns ASAP. No, what the, how about we just go uh, big little home? Ammunition. We hit up a, how I about got, this? I got an M16 upstairs with like a 10 round clip. Yeah, we need magazines too. So here's what I'm proposing. We go big or we go home. We hit North Fust Airfield, and then if that's not good enough, we hit Tissy. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, well, I mean, uh, our, I our fucking toes down about it. I mean, fuck, even if we just get some like basic automatics, like fucking 
baby eight keys and like some fucking M16s is like it's better than fucking. Mm, even nothing. even that would be good. Yeah, we need plate carriers too. Well, I need a plate carrier. <laughs> I ain't got nothing yeah. on my chest. <laughs> that Lamias, that's mine though. I don't want to share that. And the KA101, I know Vito wanted that too. Yeah, I think the Lamas is more for defending anyway, you know. Fucking, as it shoots too fast to be used. Yeah, that like, Lamas, you know, I'm gonna have to find there. some mags for that for sure. Right. Yeah, yeah, man, using the Lamas to hold down the stairway here. Yeah. And with the plan set in stone, we started to make our way towards the northwest airfield to find some big guns, big bullets, oh. and big oh, fucking well, explosives. So if this war did ever break out, we'd be fucking prepared. I think we're going to the airfield. Okay. Just, just, you're going to the airfield, I'm just uh, taking okay, this, okay. you know, to the scenic route so we can hide it. Okay, so, okay. Uh, smart, smart, smart. Oh, I forgot, I forgot why I'm not in the fucking front seat. <laughs> That's what you get, buddy. You fuck! <laughs> Yo, did uh... you saw off your Mosin? Yeah, he did. Why do you have two bolt actions? Hey, we didn't have to watch at the time. We got to be good. Yeah, no. Yeah, I, I didn't realize, uh... My pockets were completely fucking full. Well, you know what, though? You got a gun, so I mean, you can shoot. Yeah. Plus, looks like he's about ready to do some breaking and entering over in Detroit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, he looks like he's about to do like a fucking uh, a hike from the fucking mountains. In my, in my opinion. Yeah, but I mean, with the plate carrier and the guns and shit, you know? Uh, Making it look like the Detroit special. Or like a fucking Texas Freedom fight or some shit? Oh, uh, maybe, maybe. And this is where the real work begins. Now, there's something you gotta know about these uh, types of places we go into sometimes. They're very fucking dangerous. They're like, uh, how do I put it? Like no man's land. You go in there, you don't know if you come back out or not. Because if someone sees you, and they don't know who you are, more than likely, you're gonna get fucking shot. Because in these places, the whole concept of love thy neighbor don't fucking exist. All those rules go out the fucking window. You either walk out of there alive, or you're leaving a fucking body back. Or better yet, you're fucking rotting in the middle of the ground. Uh, this little L shape building right here. It's like, it's my already fucking hit this place. Holy shit. Uh, what'd you find? Oh, yeah, that's good. We got two of those now. What'd you get? Fucking Claymore, Ronnie. Oh. One of the boom booms. Where's uh, Dante? Where's Dante? Whoa! Run! Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Shit. Follow Dante. Holy yeah, fucking shit. yeah, run. You book, book it now. Fuck, oh, it's man. on my ass like uh, flies on shit. Well, yo, we're having too many fucking close calls with them things. Man, like this is just like our fucking luck right here. Yeah, no, it's it? every fucking, fucking time one. we go somewhere. Well, you know, oh, I was luckily yeah, we were so just cool. leaving that anyway. It's time to let the fun begin.
push. But you guys keep going, you guys keep going, keep going. Oh, that was a nice hit firing right there. Get that out of here. Oh! Sorry, dog, because someone bandaged me. I got a cut. Puss, can you get him? Guys, get out of here. Hold on, hold on. Be wait. I don't, I'm, I'm popping a road for you. Since we're out of the uh, zone. There you go. Keep moving, puss. When I look at my friends, I see my family, my brothers, my sons, my nephews, and more. This is what I'm fighting for, Lisa. Men that I would die for. Men that I would kill for. Men that I would live for. You may no longer walk this earth, but I take great comfort in knowing my family is still with me. And that my family still lives. <laughs>